lifted. An African-American protest, protester ascends a step pyramid throne because his eyes are transfixed on the prize. An ancient basalt Olmec head carved from solid rock is airlifted to a museum, so its origins will be temporarily a mystery. Another African announces their displeasure with current events. Another phoneticized black man faces the death sentence. The diseased African looks up ways to get out. The death row inmate has been holed up so long he doesn't know which way the switch will flip. Even if the DNA test is proof, the indigenous man has lost his golden goose and all the eggs are in their hand-woven baskets, the ones that we gave them as gifts. Now it is painful and ironic, shameful and moronic. The goose cooks at the picnic BBQ to feed the starving settlers who knew enough native to reserve the turkey carving for the strange fruit crucified on poplar skewers for mass consumers of bestial cannibalism. Black lives matter only as much as the price of melanin per massacred men, women, and children in the planetary prison system. The undead guard the jail while the vampire wardens drink the Loud, boom, back, bloodlines of disenfranchised and downpressed. There is no rest for the weary. The unrest of the ancestors we are ascending on every time we walk anywhere is felt like the precipitation of tears. We are our ancestors as we have our heads in the clouds and cry tears of living eye water for our falling fathers, mothers, sisters, brothers, sons, Daughters, this family tree is swaying in the quiet storm and we forget about the burial grounds because the original people are beneath defeat. Our technology has been uprooted and commandeered to instill the ignoble values of ignorance and fear like Ebola vaccinations. When we wipe away the tears and look down upon the green earth, we see families still winning with the wobbly spin, waiting to have the last word. Freedom and clemency for Asada Shakur. Free all political prisoners. Connect the dots and see the big picture of unity. Fight the powers that be.